guys, welcome back to another weekly grocery haul and meal plan. Hi. Today we are here to share our haul from Aldi and Walmart. I went, uh, can't talk, I went to Aldi yesterday, Andy was off, stayed home with the kids, so I went to Aldi. I also went to the thrift store, so a thrift haul should be coming soon. Um, but I went to Aldi, got the majority of things that we needed, but there were a few things that we did want to pick up from Walmart, so I also placed a Walmart grocery pickup order, which we just went and picked up this morning. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys the meal plan for the week, then we will do the Aldi haul, and then we'll do the Walmart haul. Okay, here is our meal plan from 9-4 to 9-10. We've got burgers and fries, salmon and couscous and zucchini, spaghetti and salad, chicken thighs, dirty rice, and green beans, beef and broccoli, ramen, Elijah actually requested that again, and this time I'm going to use like a steak instead of ground beef, stuffed crust pizza, and steak chipotle bowls, and I'm going to do cilantro lime rice and black beans with that. Okay, here is everything that I got at Aldi. I spent, I believe, $132, but I will show you all the total at the end. Elijah's going to be helping out today? Yeah. Yeah. All right, we'll start over here with the produce. We got some big on the vine tomatoes and then some little grape tomatoes. These ones are the best ones, the, the cherubs. They're really sweet and delicious. We got some cilantro and then some limes back there behind the cilantro. Uh. I don't see some. You don't see the limes? That's cilantro, yep. Where's the limes? There's the limes. We got some mini cucumbers. Yum. And some strawberries. <laughs> and some broccoli. Broccoli! And some zucchini. And then I got I some more of this it. sweet peach Where's wine. The they actually restocked all of the flavors of this wine. They had the pineapple and the watermelon and the peach. But the peach one is the one that I like the best. So I got two of them. Got two gallons of milk. We usually get 2% but they were out and so we only needed two and I got whole milk. We still have orange juice from last week so I just got one and then I would have picked up two raspberry lemonades but they only had one left so we got that one. These are a new thing that I wanted to try. I think they were new this week. Fried pickle ranch flavored wavy potato chips. So I'm gonna try those. I heard they're good. Um, I like pickle flavored things. Hopefully they're not overwhelmingly pickle flavored but uh, yeah, got those to try. We got some noodles because I just like to have things like this on hand and our pantry stock is kind of getting low. So we got the rotini noodles and we got the bow tie and noodles. Then we got two cans of black beans. Again, just kind of mm -hmm. stocking up on the things that we use regularly. And then lately I've been making my own um, spaghetti sauce, but I like to keep some on hand. And we just used the last jar that we already had. So I got one of these marinara sauce and one of these tomato basil. And Lily requested couscous with salmon this week. So I wanted one of the flavored ones, but last week they were completely out of all of them. This week all they had was the original plain. Um, we usually like, like the Parmesan one or the garlic one, but we'll go with plain this time. Got some more apple cinnamon cereal bars. Lots and lots of string cheese. We're gonna have stuffed crust pizza. So we'll use some of that for that. And then they like it as snacks as well. So I went ahead and grabbed two bags just to make sure we had enough. Got some olive oil. Um, I've been buying the big bottle lately, but this one was on sale, so it actually made it cheaper to just go ahead and buy the small one. Got some Greek yogurt to make two ingredient dough. And then we got some cheese, lots of cheese, two things of sliced sharp cheddar. And then we got a block of cheddar, a block of mozzarella, a block of Monterey Jack, and a block of extra sharp cheddar. Some fries to go with our burgers. And then we got some lunch meat. We know we like this oven roasted turkey breast. Um, and then I picked up the honey ham to try this week as well by the same brand because we were out of lunch meat completely. Then we got some hard salami. Um, the kids like this kind for their homemade Lunchables. And then we got some bacon, got two packs. These are like $2.50, which is a great price mm -hmm. and it's pretty good. Got some crescent rolls just to have on hand. And then I scored on some ground beef. We were almost One. out in our freezer. So we got how many packs, Elijah? Four. Four One, packs. Two. 
play? Four. Very good. Four. So each of them was about $10, and then they had a $2 off coupon, so each came out to about $8 for two and a half pounds. All of them are like right at two and a half pounds. So I will divide each of these in half and freeze them so we will have like eight meals with that. Then we got some bread, some buns for our burgers, One. some whole wheat bread, One. some bagels to make Andy some breakfast sandwiches, toilet paper because I still can't get my hand on the Sam's Club one that we like. Um, this seemed pretty comparable so we're going to try that out. And then some cola for Andy and that is it from Aldi. Okay, so here is everything from Walmart. I believe I spent $45. As I said, totals will be at the very end. So we'll start over here. We got three cans of pumpkin. I'm gonna be making some different recipes with that. I'm gonna be doing a pumpkin themed what's for breakfast video. So that's what most of that is for. So stay tuned for that at the end of the month. We got some apple cider. I'm going to be making an apple cider donut cake. So that's also going to be another video. We got some cranberry raspberry juice and some cranberry pineapple juice. I've never actually tried the cranberry pineapple, but it sounded delicious. Then we got some self-rising flour to make Andy's two ingredient dough for breakfast sandwiches. Butter, I picked this up at Walmart because it was cheaper than Aldi. When I was in Aldi, I was like comparing prices and this was, I believe five fifty for the um, four sticks, and it was like three dollars or five fifty for the eight sticks, and it was three dollars for four sticks at Aldi. So you saved like fifty cents buying the twin pack at Walmart. We got some eggs. Aldi was out of the forty seven cent eggs, so that's why I went ahead and got the big one at Walmart and this is like three something so it was a very good deal. Elijah requested Funyuns this week so we got some Funyuns. We got some pizza sauce and some more of this Laughing Cow creamy garlic and herb cheese. I did try the Aldi brand one and it's okay but I definitely like this one better. I got two of these garlic parmesan wing seasonings just to have on hand because we did really like that. So I got two of them just to have. <clears throat> we got a spaghetti squash to eat with our spaghetti. You gonna eat some? Yummy. Mixed with your noodles. Yummy. She doesn't eat it like by itself, but she will eat it mixed with regular noodles. We got some American cheese. This is one of those things that I do not buy at Aldi either. I do not like their Aldi brand American cheese. And I don't usually buy name brand. But if I was buying it, I would be buying the craft ones at Aldi. But I went ahead and got these at Walmart. Got some pico de gallo because it's just easier than making it. And some pork sausage. Again, this is something that I do not buy at Aldi. I do not like their, like, breakfast sausage. So, pick those up from Walmart because we were out. And that is everything from Walmart. And that is going to be it for the haul this week. As I said, totals will be here on the screen. I think I'm close to either like 170 or 180 but yeah it'll be right there on the screen as always thank you guys so much for watching if you like my videos make sure you hit that subscribe button down below so you can come back and see my future videos there will be a what's for dinner on sunday and you can see all those meals that were on the meal plan so thank you guys so much for watching and we will see you in the next one bye bye